Hello friends, Lee here from Tabletop Bong. Thanks for joining me. In this video, I thought I would share with you something that I use quite often in my life. And it is a, it's kind of a life hack that, that has helped me bring the right people into my life experience over and over. You can use this trick, hack, understanding, whatever you want to call it. In the end, you can decide what to call it. But I just feel like it's just part of my life. This is just how I do things. So uh, I was thinking about this process earlier today and uh, going through it for, for something in my life. And I thought, you know what? I should just pop up a quick video and uh, and show you guys what what exactly I do when I need to attract the right people into my life. And you can use this. This is a very, very powerful technique. You can use this to attract your soulmate. You can use this to attract a new BFF. You can use this to uh, attract business opportunities, investors, job opportunities, all kinds of things. You just have to take the time to go through the steps. And it's really, it's super fun and easy if you want the truth. Um, okay, so here's what happens, all right? What we're gonna do is I'm gonna teach you a way that if you follow these steps, you will align yourself so that when the person you seek, when they show up in your life, there will be recognition from both sides. They will recognize you and you will recognize them, although you may have never met before but you will be recognized to each other as an important or significant person. Okay, so this is pretty cool, right? Like when, when the person you're looking for embodies the right, uh, the right things to match what you're looking for, what you actually need, then you'll know who they are. So here's what happens. You have to start with uh, something that I think each and every person should do uh, w without fail, should do if they've never done it, should do it right away. Okay, this is, this is a simple, simple thing that is life-changing. And what you do is you get a pen or a pencil and some paper. Okay, you're not typing this out, you're writing this out. Okay, this is really important. There's an activation between your hand and a writing utensil and the piece of paper and the universe. That same thing doesn't happen typing. It's different. I'm not sure why. I'm not going to pretend to know why. I just know it's different. So writing this down will help. It does something to our mind to see it externalized in this way, in a way that is personal to you, right? Your handwriting is like a signature, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to imagine, okay? You're going to imagine if you had to live one day over and over in your life. If you had to, like, live Groundhog Day, that movie, right, with Bill Murray, if you had to live that experience, what would that day look like? Okay, so this is, you're just going to write this down, but I don't want you to think too much about the material aspects of this. This is what, this isn't really important, okay? Material aspects don't really mean anything. What means something is what you feel, how you're engaged and what your vibration is in each and every moment of your experience, right? That is the reality that we're living. We can be thinking all kinds of things, but the vibration in our body is the reality that we live. So that's what we're going to focus on here. And how do we do that? Well, we do that simply by thinking about each thing in great detail and how we would feel and what we want to feel in each of those circumstances. So, for instance, you're going to start your day with waking up at a particular time. You know, what, what time of day would you like to wake up? If you could just pick any time, it's, you're living this over and over, there's no limitations. Right? You're not limited by money, you're not limited by time, you have one day to plan and that's it. Nothing else getting in the way. Right? So, 
You think about what time would you like to wake up? Okay, great. So you've got that figured out. So you just, okay, so my day would begin at blah, blah, blah time. So now you have a starting point. Who would you wake up with? Would there be somebody beside you? If so, who would that person be? How would you feel when you looked at them when you first opened your eyes? See how now this is going to start to shape the vibration. So you're writing down these types of details. And you're really thinking about your day. This perfect day. That you, you would be willing to live over and over because it is so perfect. And you go into all of these details and you do this for each step of your day. What would you do next? So you would wake up with this person and you would feel these beautiful things and your heart would open and you would feel this tremendous connection with them, for instance, right? Like maybe not everybody's going to feel that way, but you know, it, some people would write that. And then what's next? What do you do with that person? What do you do by yourself? How does your day move? And what are you thinking about? And what are you feeling? And just write it down. It's going to take some time. You're going to spend a couple of hours on this, likely. Uh, you know, I mean, I don't want to tell somebody how, how many pages it's going to be, but it's going to be more than a page or two, right? Like, you need to get into the details here. But if you do this, number one, you need to do this exercise regardless of attracting anyone else into your life. This is setting your vibration and setting, setting course for what you really want out of your life, how you want to feel in your life. And you'd be surprised how many of these things that you're writing down on the pages, you'd be surprised how many things on these pages or a version of these things, you'd be surprised how many of them don't just show up in your life experience over the next little while. So this is a really important thing to do, guys. This can change your whole life. Just this simple little exercise changed my life. No joke. So now how do you use this? Okay, so now... If you want to attract somebody into your life, let's say you want to attract the perfect partner, the perfect person who would match you, and you want to know who they are when they show up. So you have your perfect day, so you understand that process. You've been through it, you know what to do, you know the amount of detail that you're going to put into it and the amount of thought that's going to go into it. Now, if you're attracting the soulmate, do you believe that that process deserves at least as much time as your perfect day took to make sure that the person is a quality person and truly your soulmate and not somebody else? I would think, you know, if it takes you a couple of hours to do your perfect day, maybe a couple of hours on this exercise, it's probably a worthy investment in the rest of your time in this life experience, right? So sit down and create an avatar inside your mind of who this person is okay so if you're attracting your soulmate right start to think about what that person you know what gender would they be what would they look like what height would they be how would they smile what would their eyes look like like really create an exact picture of this person inside your mind every detail of them let's face it you know what the perfect person is for you. So create it inside your mind. Create this avatar. And once you have that avatar, give that avatar a name. Okay, it doesn't matter what the name is. Just make sure it's a name that feels right, that you would want to say <laughs> regularly, right? Like not a goofy name, something that fits. So now you have your avatar and your avatar has a name. Now this is where the magic really begins. What you do is you take from the perspective of that avatar, you create another perfect day. You create their perfect day. What you imagine their perfect day would look like. Understanding that there's going to be differences between you and any other person, right? They're going to bring different qualities. It's the things that you're looking for that they're gonna bring. So you understand who they are already because they're your perfect partner. So you understand who they are. You can create their perfect day from their perspective and write it out the same as you did your own. And then once you've done that, just put it away and go back to your life. Don't worry about it. Don't think about it. You've set course inside your mind and inside your vibratory self 
to create a connection with an appropriate person that matches all that criteria. And what's going to happen, and this is really the cool part, my friends. The very cool part is when you see that person and they see you. Because you took the time to understand them as they are, their soul will recognize your soul. It is truly a soul to soul recognition. And it's a really magical thing when it occurs. And the very first time you use this and you attract or create the connection in your life with the exact right person for where you are and you have that moment of soul to soul recognition because you've followed this program, you will realize beyond any question that it was exactly that, a soul to soul recognition, and it will make you feel comfortable and safe in that situation. You can use this for all kinds of things. Uh, if, let's say for instance, if you're a salesperson, right, you have an ideal customer. Whoever that, let's say you're a real estate agent, right? And you sell, you like to sell homes in a particular price range. You know exactly what your favorite, most um, uh, profitable client, who they would be. You know exactly who that archetype is. So create an avatar for that person and go through their perfect day and you'd be surprised how many more of those clients you get. Like it just, it works that way. This is you're creating in your experience. You're giving the universe something to answer. You're being very specific in your manifesting and you're allowing yourself to open up and to feel the vibration of what you want and of what that perfect match, <laughs> what they would want, allowing you to understand them before you even meet them on such a deep level. And let's face it, isn't that what we all want? We want somebody in our life that understands us on a deep level. Somebody that understands us different than the rest of the world. Somebody who sees through the mask that we put on when we brave going out into the world and, you know, our jobs or whatever it is that we're facing. We all change in those circumstances and become somebody a little bit different, right? Somebody a little less vulnerable. Somebody who protects a little bit here and doesn't say that thing that they're thinking about over there too. Don't we all want that soulmate in our life that sees through that? <sighs> of course we do, <laughs> right? We want friends. We want colleagues that see through that and allow us to be a little bit more real in our entire experience. You can fill your life up with people just like that by taking the time to go through this experience for each and every person that holds a significant role in your life. And I know it may seem like a time consuming thing, but I'll tell you what, <laughs> you would be surprised if you just pick one day and mark it as a special day or a specific thing that you're going to do. Years ago, I decided that I would do that on every New Year's Day. Quite often on New Year's Day, when I started this ritual, uh, I wasn't going too far on New Year's Day because I often, I'm quite honestly going to say I had a bit of a hangover, let's face it, right? So... I would be homebound and sort of licking my wounds a little bit and uh, I would sit down and I would think about the year coming and all the things and you know who's not in my life that I want and I would start on this process and I would spend the day you know uh, quite often just drinking coffee and uh, then rehydrating with water, vaping some weed and going through this process and putting the whole day into it and you'd be surprised how fast the day goes by and how good I would feel at the end of this process because all I'm doing is thinking about all the things that I want and I'm in this awesome vibration, right? So don't think about it like hard work because it's certainly not. 
it's setting the course for the future for you, for all the beautiful things in your experience that you want to bring. I mean, this is, this is manifesting at a very high level, very, very um, specifically. We all have the capability of doing it. And you can do it too. This is the formula. All you have to do is follow it. All right, guys. I uh, I just wanted to put this video together because I was thinking about this and working on this for a specific thing in my experience right now. I just thought, yeah, let's put this together. And I decided not to, you know, have any vaporizers or anything like that in the video so I could keep this open to all viewers. Because I think... Uh, you know, a life hack or a manifesting hack like this really can change your whole life. And I want as many people as possible to see this type of content. I hope that you've enjoyed this video and I hope that you take the time to run through the exercise that I've outlined here and you enjoy the benefits of it. <coughs> Thank you very much. If you enjoyed this video or got anything out of it at all, please hit that like and subscribe button. Until next time, take care.